Olivia Carter! He performed with us at our Big Jeff Ross show, Mr. John Walter Stockwell! All right, guys, who wants to go first? I don't want to. All right. I'll go first. I'll go first. All, All right. right, John goes first. Here we go, guys. Three, two, one. Rose. Olivia only lost her virginity three years ago and hasn't had sex since, <laughs> which is why if you search for Olivia on Airbnb, you'll find a lot of cute cabins in her vagina. People love to stay in deserted places. <laughs> Okay, um, <laughs> John apparently asked my ex-boyfriend for roast material, so I DM'd his wife, you got any tea on Stockwell? And, and she said, secret crypto offer, would you like to make 5,000 trading crypto for 115? You can access $5,000 in crypto. Click the link to learn more. <laughs> I met her online, what? <laughs> Is this fucked up? What the fuck is with this? God damn it. All right. I'm surprised Olivia made it here today. I always thought Home Depot put their six-foot skeletons in storage until September. <laughs> the last thing to get Olivia's pussy wet was the water that seeps into her casket. <laughs> you stole that one from Ray. <laughs> <laughs> Did somebody else say that to me? No. Oh, God. That would be crazy. Yeah, fuck it. <laughs> um... John can't afford a new tooth because he's saving up for a pussy. Um, <laughs> he actually broke his tooth eating a kettle corn he found under the couch. And it's like, don't eat it if your mom was sitting on it, you know? His mom's fat. Um, uh, I know that's mean to say, but his dad is dead, so I couldn't use him. Um, all right, I shouldn't have said that last part. I'm sorry. <laughs> I take it back. It was that, I actually <laughs> bit a piece alive. of beef jerky. <laughs> oh, okay. Well. Yeah. Yeah. So you're wrong. You're factually wrong. Um, you look like a woman that would go missing. <laughs> but knowing you, it'd be because you're such a fucking idiot and you just wandered into a hole on a construction site. <laughs> you're the first woman I've ever met that I feel like should earn less than other women. <laughs> Let's go! Maybe they just take me because I look good, you know? <laughs> that happens. Okay. Um, John John looks like he'd roofie a girl and then be like, I don't know, I think she was into me, guys. <laughs> so that's what happened to my tooth. <laughs> it was a roofie. <laughs> what? I hope Olivia gets to have kids someday. <laughs> I just think it's ironic, the idea of Olivia breastfeeding when her body looks like it's built like a carton of milk. <laughs> really curvy and, like, uh, wet? <laughs> okay. Uh, burn, I guess. Um, okay. Uh, John works for... Ex uh, Expedia because Booking.com does background checks and he's a predator. Um, <laughs> uh, they also want to hire him because they didn't want him to answer the phone like, dude, dude, uh, how can I save you money, dude? <laughs> he's like that. He's like that. <laughs> it's accurate. <laughs> You look like Ann Coulter if she found out one of every five dollars she spent at Zara went to the NRA. I don't even know who that is, so <laughs> got me. Um, okay, John looks like a Christian youth pastor who isn't allowed to baptize because he kept dunking the kids for too long. <laughs> Get out there! Catch me on the corn, I'll fucking dunk on you. <laughs> Olivia has a hard time with long-term relationships, which I get. It's gotta be tough if everyone you kiss gets cut by your razor-thin upper lip. Oh. <laughs> I'm glad you're here to tell us these things. <laughs> All right, um, John loves space. Um, he loves it so much, he's got a ton of it between his eyes. Um, <laughs> So 
Sex with John is like the space challenger. It explodes before it even gets up with five other guys. <laughs> <laughs> Olivia's favorite TV show is Outlander, a show about a woman who goes back in time to help people, which I find surprising because if Olivia could go back to 1955, she would accuse Emmett Till of talking to her. <laughs> we got one more, you guys got one more? You got one more? How you guys feeling about it? Good, good, yeah. All right, one more joke. All right, I'll do it. Um, okay, John has a pretty large TikTok following. One of the captions on one of his videos said, no offense, but you need to connect your words better. <laughs> <laughs> and I just wanted to say to John, you're doing a really good job. <laughs> I know you have a lot of brain drama, but we're all very proud of you. <laughs> Mr. Stockwell, you're on the board. Is it over? I'm trying to decide. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> hey, hey, turn it. Olivia didn't know how to read until she was in fifth grade. <laughs> You're fucking stupid. <laughs> Let's go! Yeah, for the boys! Yeah! Baby. All right, all right. Oh, find the yellow line. There we go. All right, there we go. Just Behind shot. the yellow line. There we go. Just we're just shooting. We're shooting and all the cool stuff. Give it up for Olivia. Give it up for John. <laughs> they were incredibly indignant to one of each other. One of each other. Each each other. I appreciate it. I can speak words. All right. Uh, here, well, why don't we hop in with Claire Parlett? Claire, what do you think? Okay, wow, uh, very fun. Give it up for these guys. This is great. Um, man, I feel like in the beginning it was kind of like you guys both had really strong things. I love that went missing joke, John. That was freaking hilarious. Um, Olivia, I loved your dunking the kids too long joke from the baptism. It was a little triggering for me uh, because I was uh, dunked too long one time. But I thought that was a great joke. Um, and I really liked your act outs throughout. And I think you were a little more consistent. So I'm going to give it to Olivia. All right. One for Olivia. One for Olivia. Let's go to Ben Miller. Mr. Ben Miller, what do you think? Oh, yeah. This is a very good battle. I think it was you had a tough task of topping racism. Um, <laughs> and you came pretty close. Uh, yeah, uh, Olivia, I assume you came here like because you were busy uh, doing the intro to all the AMC movies. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Does uh, I don't get it. Does that oh, like, uh, <laughs> like Nicole Kidman at the beginning. Oh, and I look like Nicole Kidman. Thank you. Uh, thank you, sir. <laughs> yeah, sure. Not all roasts have to be like mean. People laughed. We had a nice time. <laughs> oh, I, I, I was um, insulting yeah. you. Yeah. Uh, you're right, I did get weirdly insecure. Uh, <laughs> um, yeah, I, I like how my favorite, I think one of my favorite parts was, you just mentioned that his dad was dead, but then just had no jokes to follow up on that. <laughs> it's just, just a reminder, you're alone in this world. Um, <laughs> moving on, yeah, I thought it was very close. You had a bunch of big pops, but I think Olivia was funnier overall. All right, we got two for Olivia, two for That's Olivia. bullshit. <laughs> All right, two for Olivia. Let me go to Evelyn Troutman. <laughs> Evelyn Troutman, what I'm did sorry. you think? Yeah. <laughs> All right, Big Trout, what do you think? Um, yeah, this was really good, you guys. Um, I think I, you guys are both so fucking funny. I think I said that earlier in the show. I was lying. Um, these guys are no, I, uh, <laughs> no, I genuinely enjoyed this round. Um, I I love both your guys' comedy styles. Um, Olivia, your first joke was like killer. It had like so many. It has like multiple layers, um, and. Let's see. Oh, yeah, John here. Yeah, I felt like both of you guys were just so whimsical, too. That was very fun. Um, yeah, Olivia, I liked your, like, impression of John. That was, like, good. Um, John, your last joke was very dumb. I liked it. Um, <laughs> it wasn't even a joke. <laughs> I know. I know. It wasn't. Um, but anyway, Thank I you. feel... I, I appreciate it. Yeah, I feel like I'm sucking the air out of the room, so I'll wrap it up. Um, I very close. Um, I I would say um, Olivia. Um, I would go for. All right, barely. Olivia wins it. Olivia wins it. That is three two. I still want to hear from Corinda and Mark. Corinda, what do you think? Corinda to the wall. Well, I'll just say right off the bat, I have to vote for John now. Um, because I. Let's I don't go. I, Dude, I, they I hate it up. a sad sack of a loser even more than he already is. One for the fellas. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I, I literally yeah. Had, I had no notes for John the boy. Um, if that 
If that didn't happen, I would have voted for the girl, Olivia. This um, is fucking. Bl- I feel like this was like this was staged. Man. I was. This is fucking I will, uh, John. Though I will say, like on paper or Wikipedia, we're 2023. You definitely have a more interesting Wikipedia page <laughs> for the carton of milk. Uh, that was nice of you to call her a carton of milk. I would call her a glass of milk. A carton of milk has more to read on it. Uh, you did what you could with what you had, uh, but I, I'm giving it to the boy, John. One for the boy. Didn't feel good. Let's hear it for the boy. <laughs> Mark, what do you think? I think we gave the boy a chance. Uh, <laughs> uh, I think uh, I think Olivia pulled ahead early with the uh, the joke about you having a, a robot wife, which that's not true, right? It, it's Shut it's up. not. <laughs> it's not. I'm, okay. I'm meeting her in May. Yeah. All right. I shouldn't have asked you that. All right. Um, <laughs> the the I I think I think Olivia won. The one interesting uh, uh, moment to me was when you said she looked like a a, a, a gallon of milk or whatever, and then she goes, uh, "You mean like curvy and hot and wet?" And we were all like, "Oh, this is uh, that was to me the weirdest moment of the night." <laughs> <laughs> I do it again. I liked it. <laughs> 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 Because uh, and that's what I was looking for was a weird awkward moment where you were like you're pale and she goes I'm pale in a hot way and then we were all like all right let's pretend that didn't happen and that I think was my favorite moment of the night and I think Olivia wins this one guys great show Olivia Carter's your winner give it up for John Stockwell as well oh my God give it up for.